The online betting industry is already worth more than $60 billion worldwide, and it's projected to grow to over $150 billion by 2030, so a 2.5x increase in the total market size. And this presents a number of huge opportunities for investors in the space, but also for companies that are launching. So today's video, I want to talk about a new cryptocurrency project that is a company in the space that I recently invested in. It's called Chancer, and it is currently in its pre-sale stages, which you can see on their website. For those who aren't familiar, Chancer is a Web3 peer-to-peer custom betting platform with live streaming. It's ultimately the idea of its two founders, Adam and Paul Kelby, who wanted to create a place for social betting where the house doesn't always win um, using future-proof blockchain technology. So they wanted to make it completely decentralized without that intermediary in between that's always winning and always profiting the most. And they're aiming to do revolutionize ultimately how people are creating betting markets, making predictions on different events, and incentivizing accurate foresight in the Web 3.0 space. They're committed to transparency. They're committed to empowering users to design and personalize P2P markets based on their own interests and social connections. And they're ultimately trying to make it a more collaborative and community space where people can interact with friends and coworkers and community and people with similar interests to make predictions on different events, whether that's politics, whether that's sports, whatever that is, it doesn't really matter. It has all of these different uh, topics in the platform. So the way it works is Chancer is currently in pre-sale. It is in stage one of a 12-stage pre-sale. Currently, one Chancer token is equivalent to 0.01 BUSD. You could just go ahead, connect your wallet directly on their website, and I did buy some in stage one. So over time, the price is going to continue to go up, so it's better to get involved earlier rather than later because each stage, the price is just going to increase. For example, in the next stage, it's going to increase to 0.011 BUSD for one Chancer token. The things that you need to be aware of with this platform in particular is that it is in pre-sale and it hasn't launched yet, but they have a very descriptive, very comprehensive roadmap where they talk about all the different things that are going to be launched when they're going to launch, which is something I really like. And when you're looking at the roadmap, you can see in particular that we're currently in the pre-sale phase, Q2 of 2023. In this, they're going to be having the pre-sale launch of Chancer Token and Node Allocation. They're going to have their Certic Audit, which has already happened. Um, you know, they're going to announce their founding team, which they did. And they're going to start releasing other things like website, white paper, tokenomics, decentralized technical roadmap, and a few other things. Then in Q3, that is where the big excitement really starts, in my opinion. That is when you're going to start seeing the token listing on Uniswap. You're going to see listing on CoinMarketCap and CoinGecko. You're going to see a minimum of two centralized exchange listings. And you're also going to start to see a community-led UX competition, getting community feedback on the actual design of the platform. In Q4, they're going to start having other product developments and their tests where they're going to continue to evaluate, fine-tune the platform before launching a main net. And in Q4, they're going to have their market-making test net, virtual betting test net. They're going to have uh, WR, uh, web RTC live streaming test net and a few other things. And then into Q1 of 2024, they're going to have their main net with a lot of features as well. So they have a very comprehensive roadmap of what they're planning to do, what they've already done. And that is something I really like about them. There's a four or five main features in particular that differentiate Chancer from other predictive market platforms that I have seen. The first of which is that it is completely decentralized. So with Chancer, you can see that they do have their native token for the ecosystem, which is the Chancer token, which is what I bought during the presale and what you could go ahead and get if you want in the presale as well. It is a Binance Smart Chain uh, project, and this ultimately allows people to get involved in the project, get uh, Chancer tokens with very low fees and the security of Binance Smart Chain. When you're looking at the platform, in addition to having this decentralized mechanism and the Chancer token being the native token of the ecosystem, you can see that they do have live streaming as well. This is one of the biggest differentiators and the most exciting things about the Chancer project, in my opinion, because Chancer is going to use real-time communication capabilities of Google-powered uh, WebRTC to provide 
uh, their community with live streaming powers, a uniquely thrilling opportunity for the entire Chancer community to engage with wagers within your circles. So live streaming is going to be a key differentiator that I've not seen with any other predictive market um, platform out there. In addition to this, they talk about WebRTC. For those of you who aren't familiar, WebRTC is a powerful technology that enables Chancellor community to connect and compete with one another in real time um, on their social wagers. And WebRTC facilitates live video streaming and chat. They're going to allow users to watch each other's gameplay and communicate while making wagers as well. And the last thing is going to be with this validator system, Chancer, in order to have that true decentralization centralization, which we talked about with their native token. They're going to be run on validator nodes. They talk about this in their white paper a bit more if you want to check it out. But in order to have a validator node, you know, you need to have a certain number of tokens and you will benefit from that, just like you could do with other blockchains as well. But in order to become a validator on for, for the Chancer platform, you need to have 1.5 million Chancer tokens, and ultimately, you'll run your node to support the network. You'll receive rewards as well for doing that. So if you want to see more details on that, it's all in their white paper about how to become a validator, and this is going to be something over time as they continue to roll out new features and they actually launch their platform, which will be more prominent and something that you might want to look in. Right now, it's more so just in the pre-sale stage, learning about their future plans. So in addition to some of these main features, like their live streaming, like their blockchain presence, like um, WebRTC, there's a few things that stand out with their platform in particular. So when you're looking at their platform, you can see on their white paper and you can see some mock you know, designs of how it's going to look, but they talk a lot about the Chancer token and its utility for the ecosystem. With the Chancer token, it's going to be an integral part of Chancer's platform's success. Ultimately, it allows users to create um, to create and invest in the markets. And if you believe in this platform long term, Chancer tokens are only going to go up in value because the more people that use this platform, the more people that are going to need to use Chancer tokens. So that is something that you just need to keep an eye out on because Chancer token holders, they can engage in live market um, wagers. They can earn rewards, participate in the shared to earn program. They can can stake tokens, receive discounted fees. They could even become validators and many more. So that is why it is so important. So you could see they talk about how the Chancer token has a lot of different utilities. They talk about discounted fees, staking, share to earn, and many more features. And these are just what they have already announced, but I'm expecting even more to come out in the future. Last few things I want to go over with this is that it has seen a lot of press as of recently. It's been in AMB crypto. They've been in in Yahoo Finance. They've been talked about on many, many different platforms and media outlets. And I still think this is just the beginning. You can see all these different articles here where they've been on Bloomberg, Coin Journal, Market Watch, and more. And you can check those out if you want. But that's something that I also think is pretty cool. Last thing I do want to go over is that while they are having their pre sale, they have already garnered a lot of attention on social media. Their Twitter has continued to grow in just a short period of time. In about a month, they've already gained about 5,000 and followers. Their Telegram as well has gained about 5,000 members, always seeing active community posts in there as well. So if you're interested in this online um, wager community, if you're interested in this online wager industry, I would definitely say that this is worth checking out. As I talked about at the beginning of the video, the online betting industry is projected to grow to $150 billion by 2030. It is only getting more and more prominent and becoming more global. People like to use it in any country in the world. They like to be able to place wagers wherever they are. And with Chancer, it's going to be able to do that through their mobile apps. When they do launch those, they're going to make it easy for you to go and participate for any sports any ideas, anything you want to wager on, and you could easily interact with the community directly through the live stream. So worth checking out, in my opinion. I didn't put my whole life savings into this, but it is something that I think is worth adding to my portfolio. I wanted to share it with you guys um, to let you know that I added it to my portfolio, and I'll keep you updated on what happens with any new updates with it.